I'm so nervous. This is very exciting. I don't think we're gonna use those. What? <laughs> so Kate decided to paint it this color. Show it to us, mom. All right. Today's the day, Katie. We are shining, the tank is clean. Oh, the tank is clean. We are finishing this project that has been, you know, you do a project and you're like, oh, I know how I'm going to do it. And like you, you, you have a plan in your head and you're like, okay, this is, this is how it's going to work. And then part of it doesn't work out. And then you walk away and you think and think, I mean, I, I would tell you when I did this over here, when I created that, it took a lot of thinking and it didn't happen in just one, like, the plan was changed a few times because it was like, oh geez, now how am I gonna do that? How am I gonna cover this? How am I gonna make sure that these, you know, line up? Like all of it, it was, it was a lot. Well, anyway, so we've came, we come, to, we have come to a major impasse in this. If you didn't watch the vlog before a couple days ago, we tried to listen. My knees crack. We tried to staple gun some fabric in here to cover the bottom of this and the staples didn't go in far enough. Now somebody on our uh, comments up to our vlog, thank you so much, whoever that was, I don't remember your name, I'm so sorry, I don't, but suggested that if we use shorter staples that that might work. So we're gonna get some shorter, for shorter staples to cover the bottom. And just so you know, you guys, this is a project that, again, if you didn't see the video, Katie and I went to the thrift store and purchased this and it was not this color, it was yucky brown. And well, it was, brown. I say yucky brown. I mean, it was stained. It was probably nice when it was first made, well, but then it, yucky brown. yeah, but it was yucky brown. So Kate decided to paint it this color and we're going to put this fabric on top. So we're kind of making it a little bit of a funky stool and people say that it's a piano bench, which is cool. So I guess that's what we're doing. Anyway, Kate is redoing this because she's going to be um, entering it into an auction for the Habitat for Humanity fundraiser that is now tomorrow. We started this about two and a half weeks ago, maybe three weeks ago, <laughs> and it's tomorrow. So, Katie, I got an idea. You wanna come see? I would love to see. Can I throw my nuggets in the air fryer? Yes, are you using the air fryer? Oh, Katie got this for the air fryer for me for Christmas. Christmas, oh my gosh, it doesn't seem that long ago. Christmas, yes. Oh, I was going to say, it seems like it was a really long time ago. You think so? Yeah. I was thinking, was it Valentine's Day? But we haven't even had Valentine's Day yet. Here's her nuggy woogies. Throw them in. Push chicken. No. What? Don't push chicken. It's different because this isn't raw chicken. Oh. So what do you push? I'm also baking it. Oh. Instead because of air frying? What's the difference? It takes a lot less time for this one to do it. Oh, Okay. All right, there you have it. All right, hang on, guys, and we'll show you our plan for the chair, the bench. Okay, so I was having trouble with this, so of course what I do when I'm having trouble is I go to Pinterest, and I start to look for ideas. So I found a great idea on Pinterest. This is what really I really big today, sorry, guys. It is, it looks nice. She just got home from school. Ryan's not home yet because he has a full day of school. Katie has a half day of school because she's a senior and... That's what they do here, it's weird. Okay, so anyway, so this is what we're gonna do. Ready, or this is my idea. You okay. tell me what you think. Yeah. Okay, so here we go. Turn the camera around. Show it to us, Mom. All right, so I have this piece of scrap wood. Nice. We're going to cut it okay. to be a rectangle. So it goes, I mean, it's not gonna follow this, but it's gonna go along here. Okay, so the shape is gonna be a rectangle when we're done. Yeah. Okay, that's good, because I was concerned about this little, like, because I don't know if you guys can tell. Yeah, you can tell. It kind of, like, goes out and then back in, it's and so it's kind of curvy. It's very graceful and pretty, but it was yeah. cane before. So cane, like, um, like woven, you mm -hmm. know, um, wicker, whatever. And that's then when we purchased it, it was not cane anymore, but they just sort of put fabric on top of yeah. it. So, wait, we're going to cut this as a rectangle. Then what we're going to do, Katie, we're going to put the cushion on top of the rectangle and then put the fabric around it and then screw it from underneath on top here. <gasps> so how are we gonna do the pretty like embroidery things on it? I don't think we're gonna use those. What? That's okay. Yeah. As long as it's pretty. It's Is it gonna look like weird and like cut off, you know? No, I don't think so. I'll show you an example of what I saw on the- um, Pinterest? Yeah, on Pinterest. We have to go get shorter staples for the staple gun. Yes, we so do. So we're gonna go do that and yes. we'll catch up with you either in the car or at Home Depot.
finished our shopping. We have returned. And what we noticed was that when we were using the staple gun before, the last time we did it, we used really, really long staples. We thought we were using the eight millimeter staples, but we were actually using these really long 13 millimeter staples. So whoever made that comment for us on um, the comment section, thank you, you are absolutely correct. So now we're using six millimeter staples. And look at what Katie did unbelievable. Mom uh, underneath. Me. Look at her. She nice. did such a nice job. Look at underneath. It's hard to tell. Really Wait, let me, light, let me yeah, take yeah, it out of the shadow. There we go. There you go. So it's staple gun underneath. Now I'm tracing the foam. Now Katie's going to trace the foam. Do you want to see? Sure. Thank you. This is what it looks like on top right now. She's tracing the foam to be as big as that board. And then we're going to put the foam on top of the board. We're going to cut the foam first. With a fun tool that you guys can see next. Oh, I won't tell you what it is then. So Mike cut that board for us down to size because Katie measured how big we needed the board to go on top. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. All right. <laughs> it's the electric knife. That's what they said we should use. So where's your foam? It's over here. Fantastic. We're going to electric knife cut it. Oh my gosh, we've got staples for days. Okay, here we go. Now, yeah, that's a good idea. Okay, oh, I guess that's a good idea. I don't want to cut it down cord. Yeah, no, that would be bad. You got to say? Yes, can you do that? Well, you need to cut with your right hand, right? This is my right hand. Okay, perfect. I'm nervous. I think you could just start, start, well, yeah. I'd go this, this way, way, maybe, yeah, so you know. Maybe I'll just do it like this, just a little just bit. Just to get an idea. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Hold, hold this part so it has some yeah. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna start by cutting okay. right here and then we'll figure it out. Okay. Okay. Oh, there you go, Kate. So what you could do is come over here and go like this, like pull it like this way. Right. You know what right, I'm saying? Right, right, okay. Right. But I don't want to cut its own cord. It shan't. So can you help it? Yes. Not cut it so quick? But I also need to move it. Oh, I see. Here you go. Okay. I'm so nervous. This is very exciting. You raised a good point on the cord thing. Okay, hold on, hold on. I need a better, I need a better stand. Okay. Okay, she's for real. Not to be happy about. Super Bowls this weekend. Super Bowls this weekend. You've got all A's and B's right now. Okay. Happy, happy ride. Your like, outfit's interesting. Your outfit's like, very interesting. I don't know it. when we decided that. <laughs> I would never. I don't know when we decided that Ryan was um part of the show, <laughs> but I think it's me <laughs> right now. <laughs> it's me right now. So if we could just get back to right. that, that'd be really good. Just for now. <laughs> Could your day get any better? Yeah, y'all, you're in this right now? Yo! Oh, 
Valentine's Day, Ryan. Looks like you are the man. I'm the man. I'm the man. I'm the man. I'm the man. Remember that song? No. Oh, it's a great. I'm, wait, I'm the man. I'm the man on the moon. No. Oh. It's called I'm the man. By all black. Okay. All right, here we go. You got the. You have the glue. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Ready? Perfect. can screw up from the bottom. Oh, it just got glue on me. Ooh, gross. But now she's putting glue on on the top of the bench so we can then glue this onto the bench so when we screw it in, it won't move because we are very close on this edge and that edge. Ooh, I don't want your sweatshirt to get in there. And we need it to cover it exactly. So that looks really good. I think so. We should probably do this fairly quickly, yeah? Yeah. Here we go. We've decided that we needed to put a bunch of weights on this to make sure that it stays down when it's being, so the glue, when the glue dries, right, that the, it's gonna be pushed down. So Kate got our heaviest books. We got our weights from our workouts. How long okay, do we- Because this side looks pretty good when it's pushed out. How does your side look? Mine looks pretty good too. Yeah. Kate is exciting. It's a little bit wiggly, but that's okay. It's definitely homemade. I, I have to say that. No, what I mean, it's not. It's not a. Um, I think it's really pretty. It's very pretty. I mean, it's not a, a mass manufactured piece. You know what I mean? Right. It's unique. Okay, so let's clean up okay. while we're waiting for it to dry, and then the last thing we need to do is Drill put it. the screws in. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> what are you doing? Stop. I'm so down bad. Uh, What's the matter, Ryan? Do you remember when I walked in the door and I was like, Woo! Yes. Yeah, that was You're not happy anymore? Why aren't you happy yeah. anymore? I just like sat downstairs. I mean, I watched the golf tournament, which was fun. I made myself a double decker quesadilla. <laughs> okay. Sounds I, good so far. Yeah, I'm. And the, I feel like the day is slipping away, and I just feel like I came home from school, and I, I'm not doing anything. What? Why don't you run with us? Kate, he's and mad because he wants to hang out with us, and Katie and I are going to go running. Why don't you run with us? It's going to take 30 minutes. All I do is hang out with my sister. And... Do you want to time, time us running? You can time us. No. Wait, no. where are you going to run to? Right here. We're just going to run um, hill repeat. The hills? Yeah. No. It's okay. cool. Uh, but I think I might go do something with Ben. Sarah no, wait for us. We'll be done in 30 minutes. No, I think I'm going to go hang out with the boys. If that happens, then I'll return back to that fun mood. Yeah. We're not running. We're pretty much just doing a bunch of hill sprints. That's, 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 that's,
that's running. What? Wait, 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 okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan's reaction was funny, Kate. All right, we're gonna go run. You Kitty go... says these shorts are too short, and I yes, they are short shorts. But if it wasn't the winter, if it wasn't February, if you had just a t-shirt on and it was summer, that'd be one thing. But you have got a hoodie and a flannel and then shorts. It's like wearing I don't know. I guess like what Caden does. He wears a bathing suit with like a parka. <laughs> Guys, I don't understand it. All right. We're still waiting for that to dry. It's going to be dry in a few. When we get back, we'll probably screw it together and be done. Perfect. And then maybe we'll play Monopoly, maybe. Unless Dad and I decide to go out. That'd be so selfish if you did. Really? It's Friday. That's what we do. Okay. We got friends, too. <laughs> <Ugh>. <laughs> All right. I'm going to go ahead with the book. Charlie get back, gets back at 8 from his uh, tournament, and then Nate has to get back soon. But yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Bye. Hey, Love you. Yeah, I'm back in that mood, baby. Let's go. Hello, Michael John. Hola. What are you doing? It's another day we should excel, Jilly. It is, sweetheart. How did you excel today, honey? Well, I just cut down some um, weeds. You did? In the front yard. Now I want to straighten the door, the garbage door downstairs. Very nice. Yeah. All right. Making things happen. <laughs> All right. Pretty good day today. Got a lot of stuff done. We're still waiting on this to dry. But I would say that it's pretty much done. Would you say that, Katie? Mm -hmm. Yes? I'm very happy with it. Are I you? I would say that. Yes? We'll do an official photo tomorrow when it's everything's drilled in. And maybe at the, um, we'll take a picture of it at the fundraiser tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Eating some pasta. So everybody's going Off their the spoon. Off the spoon? Mm -hmm. Nice. Everybody's going in their different directions tonight. So we're going to end this vlog now. Katie, where are you going? I'm going to hang out with Katie. Alyssa, no one. Jenna and Tucker. Okay, fantastic. What made you happy today? Oh, sorry. How are you with you? Thank you. I agree with that. Making my bench. Yeah. Oh, and the two tests that I did really well on today. Oh, congratulations. Yes, that's huge. Mm -hmm. Huge. All right, what made me happy today was also hanging out with you, getting the, seeing the bench work. Like, that was really fun. We work well together. That was fun. And doing our run. We just did hill repeats out uh, on the hill in our neighborhood, and boy, oh, boy. Hard. Hard. That's why Katie's loading up on carbs right now. <laughs> Mike and Ryan are at the driving range. Um, hopefully we'll get a chance to uh, hear what made them happy today. I'm sure we will. Ryan was happy all day long and especially is happy now that he's at the driving range. So comment below what made you guys happy today. You might see Mike and Ryan. This boss made me happy today. <laughs> and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. It's happening, people. It's happening, homies all across the world. It's Ryan. It's your favorite Donnelly here. Oh! I almost slipped down the stairs. What made me happy today was going, uh, I was about to say going to school. Poor man, bro. Uh, getting home from school and being in a good mood. I made a double decker quesadilla with cheese and bacon in it, which I don't, now that I'm saying it out loud, I don't know how, like, no, it still sounds amazing. It was amazing. And, uh, it was absolutely amazing. All right. <laughs> so, comment below me. You guys have a day. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace. For the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnelly's merchandise, visit shopitsthedonnelly's.com. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.